Oh, baby. Oh my god, we're actually gonna play it. I don't know why I said it like that. I'm sorry. But I'm really excited. We're gonna play Scar Sir. Wait a minute. Oh my god. I see why. Oh, do we really need that? But there's one thing I also want to do really quick. So I had this thought when the game came out that I would wear something funny. You know how Link has the the ears and the hat? Well, I found this just lying around. So, well, I'm Link now. So yeah, <laughs> let's play Skyward Sword HD. <laughs> Tell that you humans pass down through uncounted generations. It tells of a war of unmatched scale and ferocity, the likes of which would never be seen again. One day, one dark, fateful day, the earth cracked wide, and malevolent forces rushed forth from the fissure. They mounted a brutal assault upon the surface people, driving the land into too deep despair. They burnt forests to ash, choked the land's sweet springs, and murdered without hesitation. This is that big war! But then, a hero rose. Sorry, I'm really excited. I'm actually gonna play Skyward Sword. They did all this in their lust to take the ultimate power protected by her grace, Grace, the goddess Hylia. The goddess Hylia. Ooh, yes! The power she guarded was without equal. Handed down by gods of old, this power gave its holder the means to make any desire a reality. Such was the might of the ultimate power that the old ones placed it in the care of the goddess. To prevent this great power from falling into the hands of evil swarming, the lands, the goddess, gathered the surviving humans on an outcropping of earth. On an, on an, they sent it skyward, beyond the reach of the demonic hordes, beyond even the clouds. We're going, we're going, we're going pretty, pretty sky high. But the human safety goddess joined forces with the land dwellers and fought the evil forces, sealing them away. At last, peace was restored to the surface. This is a tale that you humans have told for many ages, generation to generation. But there are other legends, long hidden away from memory, that are intertwined with this tale. Now, a new legend bound to this great story stands ready to be revealed. Skyward Sword HD, a legend that will be forged by your own hand. Yeah, my joy comes. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh no! Well, here it is! Put the Joy-Con R. That's a little better. I don't know what's going on with my controllers though. Are they almost dead? No.
Alright, oh god. Alright, let's call this Montez, because that's what we are. We are Montez. This is what this channel is kind of built on in a way. Oh, yes. <gasps> Look what's going on? Oh, the ground is breaking. Oh, the evil forces have been unsealed. That's pretty, pretty creepy. That is actually terrifying. Nintendo presents. I love how they do this with Zelda, like they did this in Age of Calamity. The Legend of Zelda. They did this! They did this! Skyward Sword. HD. No? Okay. Oh! We're in, what was it again? Skyloft? Or Loft World? Loft Realm? Ooh, blue? Red? We saw this in the trailer, so nothing really new there. Yeah, this is Skyloft. Man, what a beautiful place. The art style of this game is just so colorful. It's like it focuses more on... Well, uh, apparently this game is based off, like, old art. Like, the art style was based off some some really old ancient art. And it works. It works incredibly well. Oh, the amiibo. There's the amiibo. The amiibo apparently is really broken. Oh, I want to play. Yeah, something's up. Uh, it's it's right below us, like deep down. You know, there's a crack in the world below us. The the surface, in a way, Link. Yeah, see, he knew. He knew. He knew what happened. Rise, Montez. The time has come for you to awaken. You are fated to have a hand in the great destiny, and it will soon find you. The time has come for you to awaken. Maltes. I'm ready. Oh! We're gonna play! What's going on? Oh, well, that was a rough day. That loft wing, I think, just woke you up to drop off a letter. Thank you, I guess. Copying what people do in the trailer, like the bow and arrow. Hey, sleepyhead. I know how much you like to sleep in, so I'm guessing this letter will be your alarm clock this morning. Did I guess right? Sure did. Rise and shine, Montez. Today's the wing ceremony. You promised to meet me before it starts. Remember? You better not keep me waiting, Zelda. Okay. I gotta say, I kinda look like Link. Oh. This is so cool. This is my first time ever playing Skyward Sword. The only other 3D Zelda I have played was Breath of the Wild. So this is like my first, like, other 3D Zelda game. Oh, I got rupees. Yeah, that would probably make sense. Bookshelf. Got this table. Open the door. Okay, I don't need to reset gyro. I just wanted to check that the gyro was fine, because it's a little, like, finicky. 
Yeah, don't use motion controls for camera. Okay. Okay. Tilt R to move the camera. Like, these controls are actually better because the Wii didn't have a right stick, so you'd always have to do this, like, lock thing if you wanted to move in a different direction. It's weird. We also have stamina. The music is just very, very nice. You're too late for breakfast. We stopped serving hours ago. You'll have to wait for lunch. Uh, it's okay, but we gotta go meet Zelda, remember? So we gotta we gotta find a way out this way, probably. There we go. Yep. Into the world we go. Skyloft, yeah, I knew it. All right, let's go. Hey, Montez, up here. No. Good morning to you, Montez. Today's the finally, today's finally the day of the long-awaited wing ceremony. Are you feeling ready? Oh, I just remember, there's something I'd like to ask you about. <coughs> And target me and we can have a quick chat. Aim at your target and hold GL. That's weird. Excellent. Always remember you can target someone and talk to them easily. And even where there isn't anything to target, it's a convenient way to quickly face your view forward. Oh, but it's a little silly to carry on the conversation from this distance. Why don't you come join me up here? Yeah, that's how they used to. You should be able to climb up if you dash up to the top of that wooden box, don't you think? Then you can make that jump fairly easy. Try climbing up there. I know. Uh, I'm just quickly... Yeah, this is how they had to... Like, if they wanted to move in a different direction, they'd have to actually lock. Then they go this direction. Or something like that. What is this? Is, that, is this part of the wing ceremony? Bird statue. Save. Yes. Okay. Target and talk. What are you up to? Rushing to get some last minute bird practice in the morning, Montez? Oh, you have someone to meet? Ah, uh, Zelda's waiting for you, is she? Perfect timing then! You should see Zelda's father, Headmaster Gapora, has a pet named Mia. Oh, you see Zelda's father, Headmaster Gapora, has a pet named Mia. And well, she scampered off again. Look, there she is, over there, do you see her? The headmaster is so busy working with Zelda's preparing for the ceremony. I thought that maybe I should feed her, but the ceremony's about to start. And I just put on a new set of clothes, and well, you see, will you help me out and go retrieve Mia for me? I'm on it. Ooh. Fantastic, so you do it? I know you're in a hurry, so I really appreciate your taking the time to help. You should be able to climb up somewhere over there. If you hang off the ledge there, you can climb onto the roof to the other side. I'm terribly sorry, but I know you're quite the climber. I really do appreciate it. I guess I go through here. Oh, I can't open that. Oh! So we have like an auto jump kind of thing. Move the box. Yeah. This way. Oh, 
Alright, we got Mia. Alright. Now we go back. And we give it to him. Here you go. Nice work. You brought her back safe and sound. Sorry for troubling you with this. I know you're busy, Montez. I suppose I should feed Mia now. Please tell the headmaster that we found his pet. He should be up by the statue of the goddess. I believe Zelda is there with him, so you should hurry along. Oh yes, I should give you a reward. It's not much, but please take this. And don't tell, er, don't tell the others. You got a red rupee. It's worth 20 rupees. Don't spend it all in one place. Oh, what's that? You got a stamina fruit. The peculiar fruit replenishes your stamina gauge. Wow, this place is... Like, it's Zelda in the sky. It's Breath of the Wild, you know? It's Breath of the Wild 2. Oh, there's Zelda. Oh, no. Ha. Oh, youth guided by the servant of the Goddess, unite earth and sky, bring light to the land. Hey, good morning, Montez. Hi, Zelda. How are you? I'm glad to see my loft twin got you out of bed. Yeah, I sure did. I was pretty sure you'd sleep. I'm pretty sure you're sleeping and forget to meet me this morning. But look, this instrument, and look at this outfit. They're mine to use today in the ceremony, since I'll be playing the role of the goddess. Aren't they beautiful? Especially this instrument. They tell me it's just like the one the goddess was said to have in the legends. It sounds gorgeous, too. I asked father about it, and he says it's called a harp. <laughs> and look at these clothes. I made this wrap myself, and we get to use it in today's ceremony. Between the harp and this outfit, I'm going to make a great goddess today. I got you up early this morning because I wanted you to be the first to see me like this, Montez. Oh, thank you. So how do I look? You look great. Yeah, I think so too. But it's nice to know you agree. Thanks, Montez. Ah, there you are, Zelda. Are you all prepared for today's ceremony? Oh, hello, Father. Ah, uh, Montez, you're here too. Outstanding. It's encouraging to see you up so early, given your capacity for sleep. No doubt today's ceremony had you too excited to close your eyes for once. If you win today's ceremonial race, you get to participate in the post-race ritual with Zelda, so give it your best out there. Yes, about that. Father, I don't know if you can do it. Recently, Montez hasn't been practicing much at all for the ceremony. Hmm. And even when he's out riding his loft wing, he's just lazily gliding around, probably daydreaming. I don't know what he's thinking. He's going to have to be in perfect control of his bird to win today. No need to worry yourself, Zelda. Though you may have a point, today's ceremony, wing ceremony tests the skill of the rider as well as his bond to his bird. Victory will not come easily. And as you pointed out, I haven't seen him practicing as hard as some of the other students. But you've known him since you were both very little. You should know better than to fret about him. You see, Montez and his loft wing share a special connection. I've never seen anything quite like it. As you know, each of us in Skyloft is but one half of a pair. We are only made whole by our loft wings, the guardian birds that the goddess bestows upon each of us as a symbol of her divine protection. When we are young, every one of us meets <coughs> our loft wing under the great statue of the goddess. It's quite a big moment, as I'm sure you recall. Ah, uh, but that first meeting between Montez and his loft wing was extraordinary. 
but the bird that came to him was a crimson loftwing. It is a breed so rare, we were sure for some time that he had vanished from the line. Yes, and the boy and his bird seemed to share a profound connection from the moment they met. Do you recall when Montez and that loftwing of when Montez and that loftwing of his first met? What a sight. Oh, well that makes sense. The little boy just hopped onto that bird and gracefully flew away. Without even a moment of instruction, they were meant for each other. And judging by how jealous you were that day, I'd say the friendship he shared with his bird didn't go unnoticed by you. <clears throat> what? Ah, but who can blame you? I'm sure you weren't the one envious of the powerful bond shared by Montez and his bird. Anyone who is part of something special is bound to catch some nasty looks sooner or later. Who? <laughs> this contest is nothing to laugh at, Father. This ceremony is part of the final test for those training to become the Knights of Skyloft. If Montez doesn't fly fast enough during the race, what if Montez messes up his big chance? What if he's not allowed to become a knight? Calm down, my dear. It'll be fine. Honestly, it's almost as though you were... You became a completely different person when you worry about Montez. You become caring. Listen, Montez. You'd better fly your heart out today. At the very least, you need to squeeze in a little time. Practice time before the race. Yes, I do. Come on. You'll thank me later. Okay, so how do I ride this... The... The... The bird... Here we are. Go on now. Jump off the edge and call your loft swing. It's time for the ceremony. So try to practice seriously for once. Hmm. Oh yeah? You can't sense your bird out there. Oh, I get it. You're trying to weasel out of having to practice. Nice try, but you're not fooling me. Off you go! What? That was rude! Let me see this crimson loft wing. Hmm. His bird sure is taking a long time to get here. Something's wrong. Oh no. Uh oh. Uh oh. Hang in there, Montez. I've got you. Whoa. What happened? Where's the bird? Oh, huh? Are you two all right? I'm sorry, my friend. I didn't mean to push you hard. You didn't sprain your wing, did you? This is very odd, Montez. What could have possibly happened to your loft wing? For a bird to ignore the call of his master, it's unheard of. And you still can't sense your bird nearby, eh, Montes? This is quite a problem, especially considering the wing ceremony is about to start. Montes, when you said you couldn't sense your loft wing, well, I should have believed you. I'm sorry. I need to tend to my own loft wing, so I'll catch up with you later. You better go on ahead and see if you can find where your bird has gone. This game is full of cutscenes. We had like three, five minutes of gameplay at max. The next, the rest 20 were literally just cutscenes. My, how did it get to be so late? If I recall correctly, this year Instructor Horowell is presiding over the ceremony. Montez, you should go explain the situation to him and see if he's willing to delay the race a little. Ugh. Delay the race a little so that you can find a bird. But father, you're the headmaster of the academy. If Montez asks Instructor Horwell, he'll probably just come to you about it. Ah, uh, quite true. As usual, you make an excellent point. Very well. I'll explain the situation to him myself. Montez, run along and tell Instructor Horwell to come see me at my quarters. Yes, more gameplay. So... 
from where he was looking, he was looking down here. Oh, that's cool. You just like look around, see the environment. You just kind of look around, enjoy the environment. What is that? I don't know, but we gotta get down there. I mean, Link runs really fast, like just like jogging as well. If something is something wrong, what's the big hurry? What your loft wing is missing? But I just saw him. Groose's bird was chasing off the feather fella. Which way? Uh, I think. Uh, well, to be honest. I don't really know where they went. Oh, thanks. Ooh, what's this? Sparring hall. Oh. Probably has something to do with like some kind of training maybe? Okay. Oh, maybe use this? Bird statue. Okay. Well, I kind of need to get... Oh. Oh! That's pretty... Well, well. Well, I kind of need this gate to open. Or else, how, how else do I go about getting there? Oh. Whoa. Black sling. Okay. Oh, there it is. Okay. Watch your step there. You can't always depend on knights, knights like me to swoop in and save you. Thanks. Huh. Oh, that doesn't really help. I love using motion controls in games. Okay, quickly. How do I get there? Don't worry, Montez. I'll be sure to explain your predicament to Instructor Horro. Go find him and ask him to meet me in my quarters. While we chat, why don't you go ask some of the other students about your bird? I seem to recall a few of them were gathered near the plaza. Down at the south of Skyloft, that place with an X marks the plaza. We'll be holding the wing ceremony there today. Okay, right there. That's the Knight Academy. Bird statue. Oh, we were here. Sparring Hall. Sparring Hall. Have you read a map before? You can press Y at any time to see a map in the area. Thank you. But I would... What? There's the bazaar. There's the plaza. Light tower. Graveyard. Well, I kind of need to find my bird. Gotta find this crimson. Gotta find this crimson bird. Any chance... Oh. Oh! There's that little thing over there, but still got more questions, eh? Groose. 
Oh, Gruson and his little cronies were saying that they were heading down to the wing ceremony in the plaza. Thank you! So Micah says that might be in the plaza. Normally the fastest way there is just down this path, but this gate here still needs some work before it open. Can you go around through the academy? I'm already check the map with Y before you get lost. Yeah, this! How did I not see that before? It was either locked or we just couldn't access it. Oh, that is, that's a lot easier now. What's up, little man? Hold up, Montez. Hey, hey, Montez. Could you help me with something? All you have to do is dash and roll into the tree. Just like I've been doing. Dash, then you're in front of the tree. Bam! You do a roll right to it. So come on. Please. Oh, that is... That is weird. Woo! You did it! A sky stag beetle! Wait up! Oh, I got rupees. Thank you. Thank you for your generous donation. That's probably gonna be useful soon or then later. I'm guessing this is the plaza. No, no, we're this is bizarre. Okay. So that is where we were before. Down there is the plaza, yep. Yeah, we're going the right way. Hi. going on such a beautiful day but we're too busy to enjoy it some things never change isn't isn't that the truth the only thing my lug nut of a son is good for is getting grease in her, on his shirt all I do is laundry 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 it never ends I hear you and I'm terrible at washing clothes wish I could get someone to do it for me It's a beautiful day, but we're too busy to renew it. Some things haven't changed. Skip. Hey, skip. Can I talk to just this lady? Oh, well. Guess we can't do that one yet. Can't do that one yet. Oh, can I swim? Sure can. Wow. Oh, that doesn't really... Oh, 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 oh. See this? Here we go. Man, he sounds very adult-like, Ling. Huh. 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 Whoa. What's that? Waterfall cave. Beware of blood-sucking monsters. No kids allowed. Okay, well, I can't get in there yet. I don't have any weapons. Bird statue? No. No, bird statues are, like, blue. Alright. I find a different way to the plaza. There's another way. That bridge is locked. Oh, we don't even need to go on that bridge. What's I doing? The plaza is just down here. Right down here. This is it, right? Yeah, this is the plaza. No one's here, though. So... Oh, oh, cutscene, cutscene. More cutscenes. You know, Groose, that sure was a pain with all the scratching and pecking. Of course it was. You thought a big crimson loft wing like that was gonna go down with a fight? But we got him, and I don't care how tough those birds are supposed to be. He's not getting out of that pen anytime soon, boys. <clears throat> Scared yet? Whoa, Montes! So, uh, yeah, just how long you been standing there? Quite some time. Now give me my bird back. What's your problem, anyway? Oh, wait, I've got it. 
You're here to talk about today's race. I can see it in those dopey eyes of yours. They're planning, oh, Groose, can you please find it in your heart to let me win today, please? You're just desperate to win so you can get some alone time with Zelda up in the up on the statue of the goddess at the end of the ceremony. <laughs> well, sorry, pal. Gruus doesn't do charity for whims. My advice, work hard and wish with all your heart. You might even come close, come in second. Say, come to think of it, how come I don't see your bird? Where is that scruffy pile of red feathers? Can't imagine what could have happened to him. Don't you think his tiny brain got confused by all the clouds he got lost? Give him back! <clears throat> huh, I've got no idea what you're talking about. You know, we're all getting tired of how you never let anyone forget you and Zelda go way back. You've been friends since you were kids, big deal. Doesn't change the fact that you float through your rife with your head in the clouds. Would you wake up, straighten up, and grow a backbone already? Dopes like you are dragging our honored academy through the mud. And just who might you be talking about, Groose? Oh, uh, Zelda. Hey, nah, it's, uh... Uh... Don't even try it, Groose. You're picking on Montez again, are you? He's a student at the academy, like all of us. Why do you insist on bullying him around so much? You suppose? Suppose what? I... I suppose... You... Oh my god, he has a crush. Forget it. I wasn't supposing anything, okay? Yeah. Okay, we're out of here, boys. Later, Montez, hope you find your bird, or else you're gonna have to sit out today's race. That could be a major setback toward... Knighthood. So find that bird, or get real used to the taste of failure. It's your special flavor. Oh, I can't wait to race him and just... ANNIHILATE him. I hate to say it, but I'm beginning to suspect that those blockheads have something to do with your loft wing's disappearance. Montez, those guys aren't going to help us find a bird, so we better start searching. I'll fly around Skyloft and see if I can spot any trace of your bird. Thank you, Zelda. Father said he talked to Instructor Horwell about delaying the start of the wing ceremony. So don't worry, we'll find your bird in time. Oh, well, I need to find him and tell him that to go meet your dad in the quarters. I gotta find Professor Horwell. Are you Professor Horwell? Or are you? Keith, what's wrong, Montez? What, your loft wing is... Missing? That's terrible. I was so looking forward to see that red blur streak through the sky. No, no. I haven't seen him. Why don't you look for him by the Statue of the Goddess? You'll have a good view of the whole town from way up there. The Statue of the Goddess is the great big statue north of Skyloft. That's the place with the X mark. Oh my god, I was already there. Thanks, but I need to find Professor Horwell. Where could Professor Horwell be? You're not Professor Horwell. Laundry people are still talking. Well, I guess I just go up to the goddess Helia. In the next episode. Because this video is actually getting pretty long. So... Thank you guys for watching. This is actually a really, really, really fun game. Uh, and I wholly recommend it. Unless you don't, if you don't get annoyed by too many cutscenes, then this is the perfect game for you. Anyways, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye! What a fun game.